this is my my beef with H4X admin pred, and I'll show it to you right now. Join game. Da, 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 da. Refresh, refresh, refresh. H4X, H4X extreme. Okay, this this is my favorite server, despite what goes on here. You have been temporarily banned from this server. Your ban will expire 29 days, 21 hours, 11 minutes. Reason for this ban, acting stupid. Stupid. S-T-U-I-P-E-D. Yes, I'm banned for acting stupid. Okay, uh, let me explain this really quick. I was banned. I, I, I'm. I can only guess. I don't have this confirmed, but I could only guess that I was banned by Pred, H4X admin Pred, and I, I'm guessing this for a num number of reasons. Um, first and foremost, he's the only one that would spell stupid wrong while banning somebody and calling the, um, saying that they're acting stupid and the irony in it is that he can't spell stupid. Um, that would be my first guess. Second guess is because he was in the server. Uh, third guess is because I've been playing with several other admins for the past couple days now and none of them have banned me for any reason. Okay, so I'm going to assume it's him. Uh, another reason why is because he hates me and always bans me for no reason. So the last ban he put on me was, it said, um, not welcome. That's all it said. And so, yeah. So anyway, this would be my, my beef with Pred. And I'm just going to play a little bit on some other server or something. And let me just explain here. When Pred first came to H4X, he was a hacker. Yes, he was wall hacking. Uh, no doubt about it. Now, he... I caught him wall hacking, and at the time, I was an admin. And you know what? Since I was a good and fair admin, and I always gave people chances and warnings... And I was always very lenient with everybody. Yes, I, instead of immediately banning this hacker, Pred, um, I kindly asked him to remove his hat. And um, we had a little, you know, a little back and forth about he, he um, you know, eventually said, okay, he would remove his hacks as I called him out on it. He played dumb, which Pred is really good at. That's like his head playing dumb, either that or maybe he really is, but I don't know. But anyway, so he, you know, he couldn't deny it, and so he actually did remove his hacks, and I thought that that was pretty notable. And I thought, hey, this guy's not hacking anymore, so I'm going to let him stay. And like I said, I was an admin at the time, and I let him stay. And then, because I was impressed with the fact that he actually um, took off his hacks and started playing by the rules then uh, after a short while i invited him into the h4x clan and he became a member and accepted and then eventually after being cool with him over this um you know course of time i invited him to be an admin and so yes h4x pred the admin who continues to ban me unjustly unfairly and without any real good reason or cause any justifiable cause is only an admin because I made him one. So yes, I totally regret this. Um, in all my years of playing COD 4, if there's one thing I regret the most that had to do with this game in any way, shape, or form, it is making Pred an admin. Because like I said, now I'm at his mercy and I'm not an admin anymore and he continuously bans me for no reason whatsoever. And for some reason, there's also this dumb rule that says that no admins are allowed to remove the ban of another admin. So, which ultimately what this does is gives admins free reign to be abusive tyrants and just ban people because they don't like them. And there's nothing that any other admin can do to resolve the situation or fix an unjust ban. Um, at least that's what they claim the rules are. I don't know if anybody has the, uh, the authority to override that. Maybe higher up admins, I would imagine, have this authority. But anyway, so that would be my main beef with him. I don't know if there's any more to say besides the fact that he just doesn't like me. 
Um, he's made it clear. He's mocked me. He's called me names. He's he's insulted me. He's cussed me out. Now, mind you, this is the person that I made an admin, that I invited into the clan, that I welcomed into the clan, who now tells me I'm not welcome. And he doesn't even warn me when he bans me. He doesn't say, hey, um, uh, stop. Oh, I didn't even tell you what I got banned for this time. There's a map in the extreme server that in the center of the map, there is a disco dance, a discotheque, a dance place. And it's got some like trance dance music playing and flashing lights. And it's got a little dance floor. And it's a funny little spot to go there and spin around and move up and down and jump and act like you're dancing. And I was just doing that to amuse myself. There was only like five people in the server playing team deathmatch. The game was almost over. I went in there on the dance floor, started spinning around and playing around just to have fun with myself. And actually, I wanted to see how long it would take you know, people to come by and kill me. And then after they killed me, I was curious to, to watch the, uh, the kill cam and just see what I looked like spinning around on the dance floor. So I was just having fun, playing around with myself, not doing anything harmful, not doing anything that should be offensive or hurtful to anybody else in the game wasn't breaking any known rule or any stated rule that I'm aware of that says you cannot dance or anything like that. So all of a sudden I just get this, this band that says acting stupid <laughs> in the server because I was dancing. So literally out of nowhere, no warning, a 30 day band for spinning around on the dance floor, okay? I mean, does that sound fair to anybody? Does that sound fair to you? Does that sound like, you know, what a good admin would do? Or does that sound like a jerk? Does that sound like a really bad admin who's not qualified to be an admin, who just has a personal vendetta and would like to see me banned and says I'm not welcome here and does everything in his power to just make sure that every time he sees me, I'm kicked out of the game and not welcome. So yeah, that's that's what it was. I was dancing. I'm banned without warning. Thirty days for dancing on the dance floor. So let that just sink in for a second. If you care or don't, whatever. I'm just explaining situation here that's what i'm up against and so on top of that i can't appeal to the forum because i've been blocked from the forum i've been blocked from the facebook can't appeal on the facebook i'm blocked from the server can't go into the server and appeal obviously and so that's it so i'm forced to sit here and wait out another 30-day ban um, even though I have admins who claim to be in my corner because of these, you know, arbitrary rules, so to speak, of admins not being able to unban other admins, or sorry, remove the bans of other admins. Um, because of that, then I'm just stuck, you know, banned from the server. So, you know what? I, I don't buy it. I think there's something else going on there. I think it's fishy. I think it's unjust. It's unfair. It's bad adminship. It's it's an example of an admin who is not qualified or worthy. And I totally regret making this guy an admin. And I'm not saying I don't like him as a person. I'm not saying he's an awful person or anything like that. I'm just saying he's an awful admin. I don't like him as an admin. And I wish I had made him an admin. Um, I totally regret that. And I hope that he gets kicked off from being an admin soon. I hope that the higher ups, you know, can, can not only catch on to what what kind of abuse of power is going on, but actually care enough to do something about it. Because you know there are admins who are aware of it, and either a they're powerless, or b they're not interested in in fixing the situation. So. Anyway, that's the story, and I'm going to think I've said all there is that needs to be said that I can think of. So I'm just going to play a little bit here, where this actually seems like a pretty cool server for the moment. I've never been on this map before, and uh, I seem to be doing okay. 
despite the fact that I haven't really been listening with my sound. The sound is half my game. But... Oh, come on. Same spot in. Some of these guys, they just sit in their same spot all the whole time. It's like, hello? I don't even know this map, so I don't even know how to get back to where they're at. But I feel like it's in this area. Yeah, you're just trying to go back to your same spot, I see. You hear bristling, bristling in the bushes. Brussel in the bushes. Anyway, yeah, I don't know. I mean, I could just... I could just talk about what a bad admin this guy is, I guess. He's just a really bad admin. And he needs to go. Yes, he needs to go. And honestly, I'll tell you what, what I really think his problem with me is, is that I've joked around and sort of uh, made videos where... Um, I was holding him and, you know, just being silly as I was um, holding him, basically. And so, I think he got a little butt hurt over that. And I think, I think I made him look silly and he, uh, he just couldn't cope with that. And so I think that he just doesn't like me for that reason and probably that reason alone. Maybe, I don't really know, I'm just, that's all, that's all speculation, but the idea is, uh, you know, some of these athletes just, just go ahead and abuse their power. And so my question is, my question is, is why does Prey feel that he has the right to do this and get away with it unless somebody has made him feel like he has the right to do this and get away with it. See what I mean? Like, yeah, you can say, oh, Fred is the bad admin, but what about the, the higher-ups who are allowing this kind of behavior to go on with admins? Because I know for sure that if I still had any authority in this clan, which I'm sure I'll never have again, uh, for a number of reasons, but if I did, I would definitely be fighting for a just cause here because it's not just me, it's really not about me. Like, yeah, I'm using me as an example because this is my experience, but the reality is, if he's doing this to me, how many other players stop? How many other players have experienced this? How many other players is he doing this to? Or what kind of other um, behavior is allowed to go on? with the admins like this what is you know where's the limit and, and who's allowing this type of behavior to go on among admins yeah, that's what I'm more concerned about like fine you want to ban me forever because I win every time I play not every time obviously but you know like I put up a good fight and make it very competitive and a lot of times the guys that that normally win when I'm not here have a harder time winning and so you know if that's how you want to just ban your competition just because it's the only way you can win then fine but you know I just think, I just think that it's an awful way to run a server and it's just I don't know there's no, uh, what do you call it? There's no, like, honor in that. Because even when I was an admin and I had power, I never banned people just for winning. You know, and there were times that, a lot of times, I got beat by players for one reason or another. And they may have just, they may have well just been better than me. But, but I never... You know, and if I was ever wrong, if I ever banned somebody mistakenly, which I have, where I thought they were cheating, 
we are going to let this outsider get the best of us. That's what they said. <laughs> you don't have a choice. <laughs> I <laughs> wasn't talking to you. <laughs> but they were talking about me. Talking about me. You actually do have a choice. You can always just ban me like they do in the other servers. Make sure you knife me real good for the final. Anyway, that's my story. I don't want to go on and on and on. Um, I'm going to leave it at that and leave it short. Well, the length of a game, I guess. All right. Goodbye.